Okay, today we're going to work on solving linear equations. So let's get started by um, going over the rules. When solving an, e an equation, the end goal is to get the variable variable by itself. So step one, check to see if there are any parentheses um, and distribute. If there are more than one term with a variable, move that, move them to the same side and combine them. If there are constants on the same side of the variable, move them to the other side. And the, if there is a coefficient with a variable, move it away. Remember, whatever you do to one side, in my class, we think about I see, I do. So if you see a positive or an addition, you will subtract both sides. If you see a negative or subtraction, you will add to both sides. If you see multiplication, you will divide on both sides. If you see division, you will multiply on both sides. We have an example today. So remember, first step, we said if there are parentheses, there are. So we're going to distribute or multiply this negative 2 to both terms. Negative 2 times 1 is negative 2. Negative 2 times negative 7 is a positive 14n. Nothing happened on the left side, so we're going to just rewrite that. Now, the second step, we said if there are variables on both sides, we would move them to one side. I would suggest moving the smaller, since we have a 5 and a 14, 5 is smaller. Again, it is positive, so I will do the opposite subtract 5 in on both sides. I always line that up with the other variable. So 5 in minus 5 in cancels out. I still have a 34 on the left. I bring down the equal sign and my negative 2. 14 in minus 5 in will be 9 in. The next step said to move any constants away. So on my side that has the n, the constant is a negative 2. Again, I see a negative. I do the opposite. I add 2 to both sides. Negative 2 plus 2, that'll cancel out. 34 plus 2 is 36. So I have a 36 on the left. Bring down my equal sign, and then I have the 9n still on the right. To separate the 9 from the n, I know that is multiplication. If I see multiplication, I do the opposite, which is division. I'm going to divide both sides by that 9. 9, 9, that cancels out, I have an n. 36 divided by 9 is 4. Now I've solved for my equation. However, best form, I like the variable first. I'm just switching sides. n is 4, and we're done. Now, if you're in my class, you know I like for you to um, put it back in to check. So if you do that, Every time you see an N, we're going to replace it with a 4. So I'm going to use a different color so we can see our new work. 5 times 4 plus 34 equals negative 2 parentheses. Oops, I ran out of room. Parentheses 1 minus 7. Replace the N with a 4. That is, of course, a little crazy because I had to go to the side. I'm going to go ahead and do the math though. 5 times 4 is 20 plus 34. I'm going to go ahead and multiply that 7 times 4 first. So now I have negative 7 times 4 is negative 28. 1 minus 28 is negative 27. And now we can solve last step on both sides. 20 plus 34 is 54. And negative 2 times negative 27 is a positive 54. This checks out. When I plug in 4 for n, it'll make the statement true. So we are finished.